Yeah. What the fuck is up? K squat. I gotta lean down because my counter is not that tall. So today we're gonna be making some vegan pancakes, baby. Oh shit, vegan pancakes, kid? Are pancakes vegan? No, Karen, they're not fucking vegan, okay? Grow the fuck up. Now I haven't made vegan pancakes in a very long time. So I I I was I, I woke up today and I woke up very early for once, so I have time to actually make breakfast, which is cool. I never have breakfast because I always wake up and it's like one o'clock. No one eats breakfast then. But if you want, you can. You can can make these pancakes at, at nighttime at at dusk or is that which one's dusk what is the morning dusk or is the the evening dawn which one is can you not hey So vegan pancakes. I've never done like a cooking video before. This is not gonna go well. Yeah, I, I, I'm trying to branch out into more vlogs, more other content, cause it's fun to make. It's not, you know, sometimes you get, you get bored just sitting in that fucking green ass, lime ass room. And you just wanna just make videos somewhere else. So we're gonna make a little cooking video and uh, I will encourage you guys before this video starts to go vegan. Uh, I'm not gonna preach about it. I always say it in my videos. I always say go vegan. And I was like, hey, go but seriously, uh, it's better. It, it's like a three. It's a, it's like three. You know, three strikes you're out. But it's like three strikes. Good job. Uh, it's better for the planet by not buying any animal products. There's less demand for the animal products, which means less slaughtering of the animals, which means less pollution to our planet. Number two, it's good for the animals because, you know, less demand for the animals is means less killing of the animals and torturing of the animals. And number three, it's very good for you. You, uh, it's, it's, it's a healthy lifestyle being vegan. So, I'm done preaching. Let's make these fucking pancakes, baby. By the way, these are, uh, chocolate chip. We're gonna make chocolate chip, vegan chocolate chip pancakes, okay? So it's gonna be some extra shit. Let's go through these fucking ingredients. I got some music playing right now. It's just my K-pop playlist. Um, my Alexa over there. She's just chilling. This is not an ad for Amazon Alexa, but it, it's very helpful, okay? First off, we're gonna need our, uh, this is an ingredient. This is more just stuff you need for the baking. I mean, I mean you're, not, you're not just gonna whip up some pancake mix and just out of nowhere. You're gonna need, okay, so some stainless steel pots. I mean, they don't have to be stainless. It could be any pot, really. These ones are stainless steel, though. Don't mind the flex, yeah? Yeah, I bought these stainless steel pots. A Canadian tire. For those who don't know, in Canada, Canadian tire is a place where you can get anything. Not just tires. I lied, I'm not using this one, it's too big. This, we're gonna get a smaller one. I have a lot of these, okay? Rich. We're also gonna need our pan, uh, cause they're called pancakes, not pot cakes. <laughs> so yeah, gonna need the old pan for, uh, for this one. I also have a second pan here. Uh, because I want to, you know, if you want to be quicker, you can use multiple pans if you have a big stove. Uh, if you got multiple pans like I do. You're going to want to get one cup, you know, so you can measure the exact amount of what you need. So this is one cup. I got a lot of little cups here. Once again, I've got all the goodies. Now you're, you're going to need your little, what do you call this thing? What do you call this? I don't know what you call it, but your little... It mixes everything in. You, you just like mix everything up with it. I don't know what it's called, but you can use a fork or a spoon if you don't have this contraption at home. So anything works. You even use your finger. I don't don't do that, but you can. You can make your own pancake mix from like flour and uh, you know uh, um, milk, preferably you know uh, uh, almond milk or soy milk. But we just got some old-fashioned pancake mix. It does all the good stuff. You can get this anywhere. This is just old fashioned pit. If you want your vegan, if you want to make it vegan, like I am, uh, just make sure on the back it just doesn't say there's any milk or eggs in it. You know, uh, a lot of them have milk in it, but this good old, old fashioned pancake mix. They don't make them like this anymore. It's saying your new fashion, okay? This is old fashioned pancake mix. Oh, the old fashioned pancake mix is basically just like, it's basically just flour. It's essentially just that. Well, a little bit extra. You still have to add in a bunch of other stuff, which is why you also need this stuff. You're gonna need a banana, okay? You're gonna need a banana because, listen, the banana adds a little bit of flavor, a little bit of kick to your pancakes. You don't really taste the banana, but you can definitely, you know, there's this hint and it makes everything so much better. And it's also good because it adds to the texture. You're also gonna need an applesauce. Also, uh, you don't need to have the applesauce. You can either use the banana or the applesauce. I like to use both, baby. And this is peach applesauce. You can also just taste that hint of peach when you're making the pit. This is like the perfect combo. 
peach applesauce and a banana, and banana flavored banana. So we're using these as the substitute for eggs. Usually you would put eggs in your pancakes, but instead of eggs, we're using a banana and applesauce for that consistency. And it's way better than eggs, let me tell you that. It's just like, it makes everything so much better. I Trust me on this, you're thinking, no way Cam, no fucking. No, trust me. For bigger batches, use two bananas or two applesauces, uh, but we're making a pretty small, it's just me here. <laughs> I live alone. <laughs> and by alone, I mean with many cats right on time. You're also going to need some milk. And like I said before, it's better if it's soy milk or almond milk or, or any type of milk, really. There's, you can get like a million different types of milk out there. And then you can get like cow milk from cow's titties, which are meant to feed baby cows and calves. If you, if you learn one thing from this video, even if you're not vegan, just at least stop drinking milk. That's cow titty milk. What are you doing? Those are meant for baby cows, not you. We're not human. Humans aren't supposed to drink that shit. So yeah, get a fucking carton of milk. This is a preference. Some people have like, uh, some people have non-stick cookie. I think these are non-stick. I have no idea. But they're a little dirty, honestly. I did not do a good job cleaning them, but you can spray a little, you know, a little vegetable oil on that shit, a little vegetable oil on that shit. Make sure the shit doesn't stick, you know what I mean? And we're just gonna turn those bad boys on. I like to cook right there between the three and the four. Between the three and the four, that's a sweet spot, baby. That's a sweet spot, right between the three and the four. Shit cooks perfectly. Oh, this song's so good. This song is so good, baby. <laughs> Turn that shit down, because uh, the neighbors might uh, knock my door down. I'm just gonna open this pancake mix with a knife. Do this carefully at home, okay? Don't cut yourself. And recycle, I'm putting this in the recycling, okay? I'm not gonna show you, but you need to trust me, okay? Fucking trust me. We're gonna do here is just gonna put one, we're gonna fill this cup up. We need one cup of the pancake mix. One cup, one cup perfectly. Cup. Oh god, oh boy, right there, right there. Oh, we're, we're making a mess here. Oh, we're making a big mess. That's okay though, listen. It's not fun if you don't make a mess. That's what they say. I'm gonna dump that right in there. I'm actually just gonna get all the, get all the residue into the, into the big bowl here. Right there, that's how you know I've done a fine job, all right? Beautiful. Tata says hello, by the way. Now that we have a full cup of that, we're gonna need three fourths. Three fourths of the milk, okay? So look, you should have little measurements on your cup. Uh, it should say, I I'm at about three fourths right now. Or th you could also say uh, three quarters for normal fucking people. Why am I saying three fourths? Add that shit in right there. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, we like it just like that. And this is vanilla soy milk, by the way. Uh, I like a little vanilla flavor. So these are gonna be a little bit vanilla, a little bit peach, a little bit banana, you know? It's gonna be a mixture of so many different flavors in this pancake. Next, we're gonna put that applesauce right in there, baby. Oh yeah, oh that applesauce is going right in. Right in, baby. A little bit. Oh yeah. Putting that in the recycling? I am, I trust me. Finally, we're gonna put this beautiful banana right in there. I've washed my hands, okay, I've washed my hands. Some people cut them, some people cut them. I, I don't, I just kinda just, just throw it in there, all by, you know. I like to put in about three quarters of the banana, or else it's like too banana-y, you feel me? And then I just, I eat the rest. Oh no. We got ourselves a beautiful concoction right there. I know that looks delicious. Now we're gonna mix everything and uh, I'll probably just do like a little time loop here uh, to save some time. One thing that I've quickly found is this is not a good thing to use. Everything gets stuck in there. Just use a fork. Just use a fork. Gonna need to add a little bit more milk. Uh, your boy miscalculated. I think I put in a little too much pancake mix. Uh, so we're gonna put a little bit of milk. A little bit of milk, just like that. Yep. Yeah. Just kind of gotta look at the consistency, and if it's a good consistency, you don't need to add more milk. But if it's if it's a little, you know, a little rough, a little thick, depends how you like your pancakes. Really, you like them thick pancakes, you leave it thick. Oh yeah, she's looking good now. She's looking real nice. Look at that. Basically, just keep stirring until all those little pancake bits are, are just like gone. It's all just like swallowed by the pancake mix, and there's no like big chunks of banana because no one wants to bite into a big chunk of banana unless you're having a banana. Got a little pancake mix on the hat. Cam, are we ready to, to finally put the pancakes on the on, on the freaking stove, dude? No, we're not, okay? We have to put in the chocolate chips. Last but not least, these are dark chocolate, oh fuck. These are dark chocolate chips. You can get them at most grocery stores. There's no milk product in them, no dairy. So, uh, your boy, when you're vegan, you just have to eat dark chocolate. And it's good, okay? It's good. I don't wanna hear shit about it being bitter, okay? It's fucking good. Of course, for you non-vegans, you can just use normal, regular old boring chocolate chips. With mint, with mint. <laughs> 
got a pair of scissors at home, you know, you just cut the bag. I mean, if you don't want to open a bag, I think uh, it might not be the video for you. Marceline's chilling right there. I did not notice her. Marceline, how are you? Are we making pancakes today? Look at the camera, Marceline. Marceline, stop walking away from me. Marceline, Marceline. No. You'll never leave me, will you, Pinball? All right, so we're gonna pour in a decent amount of chocolate. Listen, I love chocolate chips, okay? I like making it really chocolate chippy. You might think, oh, that's a lot of chocolate chips, Cam, slow down. No, I need a lot of chocolate chip. That's good right there, though. That's a good amount. We're just gonna mix in the chocolate chips, do the whole stir thing again. And just keep mixing it until you see, like, there's chocolate chips, like, everywhere, you know? Not just on the top. You gotta have chocolate chips everywhere. That way, with every bite, there's a chocolate chip. That's the goal. You want every fucking bite in your pancake to have a chocolate chip in it. Look at that. Look at that, we are ready. Okay, I'm now gonna pour these in, okay? Wish me luck, I really hope this goes well. Oh boy, here we go, here we go. There's a nice big pancake, a nice big pancake there. I'm gonna pour it on the other one. We have a little bit left over, I'm gonna just try to fit it in on this one. Make this a little thicker, make this a nice big thick one, a big thick boy. This pancake is so thick over here, this one's really thick as well. They're both gonna be thick, and that's how we like them in this house. I'm a thick enthusiast. Now if you see here, we got, okay, I, I fucking missed a little bit, sorry, you sue me. Sue me, okay? Pancakes are chilling in there, we got the big pancake chilling in that one. We got a slightly smaller pancake, but still big. They're both thick, they're both beautiful, and they're both gonna taste amazing. So now we just wait, uh, it's probably Probably at the setting I have it on, the 3.5 setting, 350 degrees. Uh, that It should take about six or seven minutes on the first side. The second side, flip it over, it's gonna take about four minutes. So we'll see. Uh, make sure you have a little flipper, a little spatula. I mean, you can have, if you have like a plastic one at home. I got the goodies, okay? I got the big, thick boy right here, okay? She slaps. Stainless steel as well, okay? I don't skimp on my kitchen products. <laughs> One thing, just make sure you rinse out your bowls, or else you're gonna get a bunch of stuff stuck to it. So Cam's gotta do his dishes. Okay, we're a little we're a little stacked here, but make sure you wash everything out because it's gonna stick. If you have a dishwasher at home, you're fucking lucky. But still, still wash it out. Okay, still make sure it's hot water, warm water knocks off the residue. All right, faster than the cold water. Yeah. Oh, Cam, I thought this was a cooking show. This is this is everything, bro. You, I'm teaching you how to do dishes. Oh fuck! Oh, it's hot. Jesus Christ, that's hot. Jesus, fuck. Cam, Cam, how do I know if the pancakes are done? Well, see, if you see the little bubbles, see the bubbles forming on the top? The little bubbles on the top? See the bubbles, little, little plop, little plop, 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 plop. That's when you know it's just about ready. When you see more bubbles formulating at the top, that's when you know it's time to flip it over. Now, here comes the very, very important part. We gotta flip these fucking pancakes. The flip is the make or break part of making pancakes, because a bad flip ruins everything. A bad flip can fuck everything right up, so make sure this flip is sick, okay? I'm gonna do my best here. Oh boy, this is, I didn't give myself much room to work with here. Oh god, it's gonna be bad. It's gonna be a bad flip, people. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Uh-oh, she's looking a little burnt. She's looking a little burnt. She's looking a bit burnt. She's looking a little bit burnt right now. Oh no, this one's gonna fall. This one, this is a bad flip. Oh, that one's a lot better. That one's a lot better. That one looks great. This one's a little bit burnt. I burnt this one a little bit. I got a little carried away dancing to Hwasa. Uh, she, this one's a little crisp. But it's still fine. Like, that's not gonna, you're not gonna really taste anything. It's gonna be, I'm gonna layer this shit in syrup. We're gonna be fine. This one looks perfect. Oh, look at that one. Oh boy, I can't believe that one. It's, it's fantastic. I should've flipped this one sooner because it's a smaller one, right? So it takes a little bit less time to cook. That's my bad. Listen, I fucked up. I'll admit it. Leo, Leo, I fucked up. I'll admit it. I fucked up, Leo. I'm sorry. So now we gotta wait. We gotta wait like two or three minutes for them to be done. And then it's gonna, we're, we're gonna be pretty much done there. It's been a fun time, hasn't it? Time has flown by, hasn't it? It's been so much fun cooking with you. I'm gonna do more videos like these. Uh, like different, obviously cooking different vegan meals. You can watch if you want. I mean, you don't have to. Even if you're not interested in vegan cooking. If you're, just, uh, if you're just interested in cooking, I mean this is hardly cooking, it's, I'm not doing much. But I'll try to make some harder stuff if you guys have suggestions on what to make, leave them down below. Uh, also if you just just like hanging out with me, I guess this is a good type of video. Just chilling and cooking. I don't even know what to call it, cooking with Cam? There it is, that's so simple. This is still my favorite song of 2018. I know it's, it's 2019 now. It's still my favorite song uh, from 2018 though. It might just be my favorite song of 2019. I know it came out in 2018, but it's still my favorite song. Like, it's such a good song. I miss Edon. No, no, I ain't on that bad. <laughs> Oh 
course, I forgot to say this one. The piece de resistance. The freaking mother freaking. Can't you focus? Focus on Aunt Jemima, camera. Camera, what are you doing? Focus on Aunt Jemima, will you? Why are they not focusing on Aunt Jemima? Aunt Jemima is what we're supposed to focus on here. Focus on Aunt Jemima, for Christ's sake. Oh, thank God. There we go. Focus on Aunt Jemima. One pancake down. Look at that. One pancake off the, off the grill. Off the hizzy. I got both of them down now, baby. Look at these freaking bad boys. Look them real good together. I'm excited to eat these fucking pancakes. Now some people like uh, adding like a little bit of sugar on top. There's like sugar stuff you can get for it. You can like slice up some strawberries. Any other types of fruit you can put on. I don't like mixing my fruit and the pan. I like putting the fruit in the pancake, but I don't like putting fruit on top of my pancakes. I'll eat fruit with it. I'll probably cut up some apples or something. But for pancakes, I just like pancakes. Just give me the pancakes. So I'm just gonna dash some syrup on them and just go. Did anybody hear that? There's a cat fight going on. Oh my god. Hey, what's going on here? Huh? What do we got going on? Leo? You bullying Winston? Come on. You're better than that. You're better than that, Leo. Just because you're bigger. You good, Winston? Okay. Oh shit, Winston. No, no, no. Oh my god. Bruh, what's happening? Winston, you good? Oh, show! Oh my god! Winston, you good? What's happening? Are you okay, bud? Winston's shook right now. Marceline, your thoughts? Who do, who would you who would you pick in a fight, Leo or Winston? Very good. <laughs> Maverick, what's good, bro? Who would you pick? Okay, see you later, bud. <laughs> what the fuck? It's pandemonium. Well, that's the end of the video. I'm gonna eat my freaking pancakes now. I got my syrup ready. I I, I don't I eat with my hands. I literally just like rip it and then dip it. Rip and dip, baby. <laughs> rip and dip. But yeah, I got my water too, and I'm gonna I'm gonna eat these pancakes. So thanks for joining me. This is a weird angle to end the video on, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want more of these cooking videos, and uh, have a beautiful day. Love you. Mwah.